it go back and explains that that because Ishmael was the first son, and that was the son of the promise, they say, and Muhammad goes back and explains all this stuff. I'm like, this is a bunch of trash. I can't well, even read this. And, and then there's, there's a further problem <laughs> mm -hmm. because um, true Muslims believe that the Quran cannot be translated yeah. into English. Yeah. So it has to be. We don't even <laughs> know if that's yeah. the true, if that's the writing of the Quran. Because right. remember, Muslims are permitted to lie to the infidels. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. We're the infidels. Right. Well, That's guys. what they say. <laughs> yeah. Anybody who's not a Muslim is an infidel. Mm -hmm. yeah. So we don't even know if what's in the English Quran is true. Right. So it's, it's really. Do they have a practice. way of trying to convert people then? No, oh, they yes. do. Oh, yeah. And oh, the yeah. things that are happening in Syria yes. right now, oh, yeah. you either uh, convert to Islam or you're killed. Or you're taxed. Yes. Com pretty completely. In other words, it's forced. Well, they charge you taxes for being a Christian. Right. It's not yeah. love, it's not yeah. peace, it's yeah. forced right. conversion. Like, if they're allowed to lie mm -hmm. up until that point, then they just flip the script and, oh, yeah, by the way, this isn't at all what you thought exactly. it was anyway. Exactly. Okay. And their heaven's a little odd, too. I, you yeah. Know. Well, the whole... Yeah. <sighs> We can go on forever. Yeah, that's a different right. class. They're having, <laughs> women have no status. Right. In, I know that. In Islam. Right. They are still property. Mm -hmm. um, when mm -hmm. a man goes right. to their version of heaven, he gets, I don't know, how many virgins? Seven. Seven. I think it's seven. I seven. thought it was more than that. Mm -hmm. No, I thought it was 47. Wow. Seven times seven is yeah, it was right. I don't know. It's, it's a lot of Too many. Too many. However it is. Sorry. <laughs> so, right. So, end of that conversation, but this is, this is, where, it, this is where it starts. Yeah, that's like that. So, Abram is the father of the three main religions. Uh, of the Jews, Christians, and Muslims. And all traces back to here. I'm glad chapter verse 12 cleaned it up and talking to uh, whether any of you have had his power because he married a wealthy woman. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is that. Yep. Yeah. 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 Oh, really? Yeah. So okay. Really <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, yep, that's where it's at. And, you know, when I started reading this, I, was, I wondered, well, do, do Muslims circumcise? And they do. Oh. So okay. they follow the, the covenant that God gave Abram. Which makes sense because they are from Abraham. Hmm. Okay, what else? I think that's it for chapter 16, unless you guys have something else. <laughs> well, I also so. think it's important that Hagar knew that it was important to obey God. Yes. Mm -hmm. Therefore, she returned to Abram mm -hmm. and Sarai. Right. I thought it was interesting that it mentioned those in your household that you purchased as well as those in your household. Which seemed to to put a stamp of approval on slavery at, at the that time. time. From, a, mm -hmm. from a stranger, yeah. those that you purchased from time. a stranger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, slavery was an accepted practice at the time. At the end of uh, chapter sixteen, again a date. How old Abram was? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He was 66 years old. No, 86. 86, 86, 86, 86 sorry. 86, yeah. Transposition. And yeah. Okay. That's all I have for chapter 16, unless you guys have more. Oh, he gets a name change next. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> he goes under the knife. Yep. <laughs> and one other thing in, in chapter 17, verse 4. Notice that God tells Abram, you will be the father of many nations. Mm -hmm. So now it's confirming the fact that he will be the father of the Jewish nation, the Muslim nation, 
and sooner or later when Jesus comes around, the Christian nations. So it's plural as nations, whereas um, in Genesis 12, God's covenant with Abram was to make Abram a great nation. So Just one nation. Before Ishmael came about and before he's disclosing that Jesus was going to come about. So the difference between nation and nations. Back back on verse yes, sir. one, the Lord appeared to him. Moses couldn't see God because of being so holy. Mm -hmm. you know, and he declares, I am God Almighty. Walk before me and be blameless. And he wasn't burned, blinded. Mm -hmm. yep. But I show Abram fell face down. Mm -hmm. So I don't even <coughs> think he looked at God, did he? I don't think so. No, that's okay, a good point. Then, then right, the taxes they had at that point. That's a good point. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to um, check that out as we get further into the Bible. Don't we'll find out. Swamped. What? <laughs> Don't look at me. I'm swamped. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just trying to do the yeah, no, the website. As we get further into the Bible, okay. we'll find out <laughs> who has seen God. Hmm. Okay. I believe there's only a couple that have. It's well, we're going to find out. Very little. We'll find out. Okay. Oh. Plus, who has heard God's voice? That's different. A lot of people have heard God's yeah. voice. True. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. So let's, let's hold on to that thought. Because <clears throat> we're not going to find out for quite a while. Who has seen God? Okay, back to the co um, the command of circumcision or the covenant. Mm -hmm. um, there were other nations that did practice mm -hmm. circumcision yes. at that time. But when God gives the command of circumcision, it's another part of the covenant making Israel or Abram's descendants his own. And if you didn't, if you weren't, or if you didn't hold to the tradition of the circumcision, then you were cast out. Right, that's what it says. That's what it says. Mm -hmm. Including the bull in the house. Those your, who aren't. And not the your thing is, the thing to remember offspring. is you were cast off from the community, mm -hmm. but God didn't give up on you. Right. But so God didn't let me give, give up, up on you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Sorry, what else yeah. we got here? Yeah. 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 Well, he gives them name changes, mm -hmm. so they're like, you know, in a different program. <laughs> and then this is the first time that we hear that Sarah is going to be the mother of the promise. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And he but, fell face down again, but this time laughing. <laughs> and he got away with it. Yeah, no. <laughs> but right here, yeah, yeah. yeah. he laughed and said to himself. He's been through with God, and he's still... And then he asked if Thoughts Ishmael could be that. Change. You know, three years down the line, Revelation says if we make it to heaven, we do get a new name. Mm. Hallelujah. <laughs> Are you tired of Janet? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it just doesn't have a ring to it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. What else we got here? I found it. I found it interesting that um, he said every son that is eight days old. So I wonder what the significance of being eight days old or older is. We're going to find out. Why? You want to take that one? Sure. Okay. Well, I wonder when it changed. I mean, now voluntarily. I mean, a, a male child is circumcised when he's like a day or two at the most. Because usually it happens in the hospital. Exactly. And it's, and it's not a religious. Um, the Jewish do it. I was going to say the Jewish probably practice. still do it. They on do it. Is, the yes. is it bris? Bris. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or so. Yeah. So I'm. It's been a long time since we had Jewish friends that had. Of son born, but I'm sure they don't let the doctor do it. I'm sure they do it in the temple. The, really? I think the, the rabbi does it. Yeah. A girl then, what they do is they bring the, the baby. <coughs> we went to a naming for a little Jewish girl. Right. And she's brought in and named, but not. In a long, long. Very service. long service. <laughs> <laughs> 
and Grandpa wanted me to try gefilte fish, and I said no. No, thank you. yeah, because there's this huge feast afterwards. Yeah, but it was a naming. Yeah, yeah. It almost looks like what's that Norwegian fish? Lutefisk. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
-hmm. with 12 rulers. Mm -hmm. And he's going to bless Ishmael, he's going to increase his numbers, mm -hmm. but in verse 21, what does God say? But my covenant I will establish with Isaac, mm -hmm. whom Sarah will bear to you by this time next year. Yep. So right there, mm -hmm. God's saying, Ishmael is not part of the covenant. I'm going to bless him with a lot of descendants, but he's not part of this. It's going to go to Isaac and everybody who comes from Isaac. That's where they got ticked off. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. But he listened to, to Abram and he granted uh, Abram that blessing. Ooh, says he was 99 years old when he was circumcised. Mm -hmm. That just sounds painful. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, yeah. Anyways. Anyways. And then he's going to go on to father and child. <laughs> Pardon? <laughs> he's going to go on to father and child. Yeah. Probably Ouch. not right away. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anything else in chapter 7? Can we go back to... Sure. Um, 14. This really has me confused. Okay. Okay, so <laughs> if your son isn't circumcised, he can still be a Christian? Yes. He can? Yes. Yeah. Well, then what's this part about <clears throat> you'll be cut off from your people? This is the Old Testament. Right? Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> that totally threw me for a loop. Yeah. What? Now wait a minute. I mean, okay. Yeah. So don't worry about it. Okay. I mean, my son was, yeah. but I, I right. thought it was yeah, like mandatory or just what you did. Yeah. 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 Okay. At the Last Supper, Jesus says, I am the new covenant. Oh, okay, now it's coming. Okay. And faith in him alone. Right. Because if if we had to be circumcised to be saved, mm -hmm. that would mean that it was something that we could do. Right. But right. we can't earn that gift. Right. So don't worry. Okay, makes sense now. <laughs> and, and it was nothing to do with being saved. It was a sign. Yes. Mm -hmm. Of the covenant, just the sign. Yeah. Okay. Just the sign. Yeah. You'll find a lot of different things that's in the Old Testament that's not in the New. Okay. Oh, yeah, like the different yeah. foods that you can eat. Yeah, what you could do, all the other yeah. stuff. Well, you, if we were the under the Old Testament, you could never have a cheeseburger yeah. at Culver's. Yeah. Right. Oh, man. Yes. 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 You couldn't have any. I think it was animals with hooves. Oh, there's so much. No pork. That you no could, that they were unclean. You could not. have shrimp. I think. You could not have shrimp. You could have shrimp. Oh, yeah. And love. We we study the Old Testament for a lot of lot of reasons. Uh, the prophecy of Jesus, so we can we can see that um, the Old Testament was looking forward to him, always coming forward. We see uh, the truth that God's love was always was always for us throughout the Bible. We see um, that we should share our faith in um, in the Shema in Deuteronomy. It tells us talk about um, God while you're laying down, while you're sitting, while you're in your house, or when you're out of the house. Wear symbols of God. Put it on your doors, doorposts. So these themes are throughout the Bible. The things that we should do, and then Jesus in the New Testament is the, the satisfaction of the Old Testament. I remember back when I first tried to read the Old Testament, I just got bogged down in Numbers and Leviticus mm -hmm. yes. and mm -hmm. all those mm -hmm. Chronicles. Mm -hmm. it, it's going to be a struggle when we get mm -hmm. to Numbers and Leviticus. Um, my Bible teacher from Wisconsin mm -hmm. gave me a book, Leviticus of Lit as Literature. So <laughs> I'll try to be using that as we go through Leviticus to try to make it a little bit palatable. And we'll look at Leviticus as the laws and what they had to do to give God a good sacrifice. So there's a purpose for everything in the Bible. But when, when studying those books, though, 
to just sit down and try to read through them, yeah, they're very boring. But when you're studying them and trying to understand them, right. it can be very interesting. Yeah, mm -hmm. and that's where we should let questions pop up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Why did they cut the birds in half? Why did they do this? Why did they splash blood all over the place? We're going to find out. Exciting. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, we should finish this in three years. Oh, we're yeah. Maybe. Maybe three years. We're gonna all age yeah. by the time we finish this. I knew I. We're all gonna get to know each other very well. Yes, yes. I'm quite okay with that. Oh my goodness. No, but did we stop? We didn't go on to 18, no, right? Next week. Um, let's see. So next week's gonna be. No. <laughs> and 19? No, what? I have one thing highlighted. I want to see if anybody else in the Bible says the same thing because I didn't okay. know about the gateway. The gateway? Uh, okay, so. Yeah. Bible gateway. Verse, oh. verse oh. 2, it says, When he lifted up his eyes, he looked. Behold, three men were standing opposite of him. If you, uh, oh, she likes verse 18. 18. She's an 18. Oh, you're an 18. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I thought we were going to do 18. Yeah, but. And she when read he ahead. saw them, <laughs> yeah. no, because that's what he told me, 15 through 18. I called yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> so and then, that's and what and I then, looked at. And I should have taken your name because it's like, oh, heck, we're only going through 17. <laughs> you, you know, I'm writing it down. I'll put it on Facebook and I'll put it on the website. Um, so. um, too, it says, okay. when he lifted up his eyes, he looked, and when he lifted up his eyes and looked, behold, three men were standing opposite him. Isn't that talking of the Trinity? I mean, and I kept reading, and it definitely, he said, he's standing beside the Lord, my Lord. I have found favor in your sight. Please do not pass my servant by. And in 18, Please do not pass your three. servant by. And it took me a while to well, in my footnotes, they, they said they were identified as angels. Mine says one of the three men was most likely a manifestation of God in human form, and the other two were angels appearing as men. Mm -hmm. yes. Abraham may not have initially recognized the visitors as God and angels. Because later on it talks about the angels going to Sodom. Yeah, but then it talks about yeah, two. I, I want to know what I happened to the other one. Through, it was well, the I think it to me that this is <laughs> 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 so, 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 18, 19, and 20? Because there's no class the following week. No, 18, 18 and 19. Why is there no class the following week?